what you saw today at St. Jude, if you could send a message to all those listeners and those viewers right now, what would that be, Claire? No pressure. <laughs> <laughs> like everyone's like, oh my God. Um, <laughs> I guess that hope is real, and hope is made real by people believing in hope. The more people, it's like believing in fairies, except you don't have black hands. You have to, uh, you have to believe. Um, there was no hope for me, and uh, I'm still here. There are a whole lot of people in this room, I'm sure, who've been in similar situations where you just think, how am I still here? And you walk the hall of, of St. Jude, and there are these beautiful little children that are, St. Jude has even thought about putting them in little carts, the little wa uh, red wagons that we don't have in Australia. But like when you have to learn to walk again, like I did, that's it's like the cutest thing in the world. <laughs> and they're all scooting down the hall, and they're happy. Hope, hope breeds happiness. Um, so I would encourage everybody to become a part of this beautiful organization. And I don't know, come and see it for yourself. Come and spend time with the kids. Come and come and tell your story. Um, I think just just get involved. I, I I wish I could be more articulate on it, but it, because it, it's just it is so overwhelming to be here. That um, believe, keep believing. You have to. Hope is the only thing that will get you through. Sometimes in the middle of the night when there is nobody around, hope. So I guess that's, that's it.